at CV and as you can see I have a new June backdrop behind me. These are the talking and singing flowers from Alice in Wonderland. I love them. I love this backdrop. I was always so fascinated by this scene as a kid. It's just amazing. And so I made sure to wear flowers and butterflies on my shirt today. All right so because I have a new backdrop that means I'll be announcing the winner of last month's backdrop. For that contest you had to send me what your color mermaid scales would be using only emojis. And that winner is Abby Awesome 123 and she said her mermaid tail colors would be pink and she sent me tons of pink emojis. So congratulations and if you would like to win this new backdrop behind me, Alice in Wonderland Talking Flowers, all you have to do is be subscribed to this channel, so my Jessie V channel, turn on your notification bell and then once again head back over to my Instagram. It is Jessie V. Give me a follow over there and DM me your favorite flower emoji. And that's all you have to do to be entered to win. Okay guys, so as you can tell by the title of today's video, I'm gonna be talking about the Akinator game. This has been highly requested for years because this game has been out for a very long time. It's been shocking people all over the world who play it. So let's get right into what exactly it is before we get into the creepier stuff. Akinator is a video game that was developed back in 2007 and during gameplay, it attempts to determine what fictional or real life character the player is thinking of by asking a series of questions. And it uses an artificial intelligence program that learns the best questions to ask through its experience with players. Now, before you go and download the app, it has this description that says, Akinator can read your mind and tell you what character you're thinking. Think of a real or fictional character and Akinator will try to guess who it is. Will you dare challenge the genie? Okay, first of all, comment down below if you've ever played this because yes, it's been around for a while. And I feel like all of you must have, right? And just before I get into the creepier side, I really want to see if he'll guess me. I'm just super curious. Does the Akinator know Jesse V? So yes, I downloaded the app. I'm going to play it in front of you guys right now. The home screen says, challenge me. I will read your mind. So let's go. Okay. Is your character a girl? Yes. Is your character real? I'm pretty sure I'm real. Does your character personally know you? So I have to pretend I'm like a regular user. So I'm going to say no. Does your character sing on stage? No, I am terrified of going on stage and definitely don't sing. Does your character often appear without a shirt? What kind of channel do you think this is? No. Is your character from YouTube? Yes. Is your character married? Yes. Does your character have any kids? Nope. Although you guys keep asking me for some. Is your character blonde? Technically I'm blonde under all this dark hair, but outwardly no. So we're gonna say no. Does your character create scary videos? Yes. Is your character obsessed with the paranormal? Yes. I think of Jesse V, YouTuber. Yes, that is me. He guessed me. He's using a very old photo though. I haven't had red hair in like four years. <laughs> okay, so he guessed me. Good on him. Okay, so as promised, let's get into the creepier stuff. There is this warning out there that you should never make the Akinator guess himself because apparently he will take offense and assume that you're trying to trick him. He would rather guess Disney princesses or movie villains or your favorite celebrity or singer. He wasn't invented to guess himself. And with that being said, if you decide to test him like that, he will indeed be able to guess himself because he knows all and he knows the trick you're trying to pull. But people have have said that when he does and it reveals his picture, something is very unsettling about it. Apparently he'll look like his normal self, but his eyes will be slightly red and his fingers will look a little bit longer than usual with long pointy nails. At this point, you should definitely delete the app and stop playing, but some people have decided to test him yet again and forced him to guess for a second time. And when he finally does and reveals his photo, it's an incredibly warped version of himself. His his eyes are glowing, his hands and fingers are incredibly long like that of a creature. His mouth is open in anger with long pointy teeth and there's this loud buzzing that starts coming from your phone. Apparently when you try to exit the app or turn off your phone, it won't let you, it stays frozen, allowing you to only be able to stare at his picture while the phone buzzing gets louder and louder. The phone has to be physically destroyed for it to stop and those who have experienced this have reported to never be able to get that buzzing and ringing sound out of their ears and it haunts them forever. So yeah, that's definitely something you wouldn't want to happen to you, but I kind of want to try this on the vlog channel. I know, 
Call me crazy, but I do. I'm just really curious about this stuff. Okay, and then we have another legend about the Akinator appearing in dreams. So I read this disturbing creepypasta that talked about how people were beginning to see the Akinator in their dreams after playing the game for a long period of time. It is said that this game was designed to draw you in, to make you want to keep playing, because the more the Akinator guesses correctly, the more you want to keep challenging him until he gets an answer answer wrong. And it's apparently really hard to make him slip up. And only few have ever done it because yes, he knows all. So the story goes that those who get sucked into the game won't even notice hours and hours going by. It's almost like you are hypnotized by the screen and that creepy face of his keeps you locked in. And by the time some people have realized they were still playing, it would be the middle of the night. And those people have gone to bed and have been plagued by dreams of him. His face constantly appearing with this evil smile and laughter that sounds inhuman. And apparently, if you see him once in your dreams, it's over for you. Because from that day on, you will never close your eyes without seeing him. Now I'm so freaked out that I'm gonna go to bed tonight and have a dream about him because I always have dreams about the things that I'm researching. So why do I feel like this is gonna go very badly for me? Because I know I'm gonna freak out if I see his face now. Anyways, so guys, those are all of the creepy things that I was able to find out about the Akinator. And I still really wanna test his limits on like what he can guess. Like would he guess something super creepy and paranormal? Like could I make him guess who Bloody Mary is? We're gonna try that right now. Okay, is your character a girl? Yes. Is your character real? Bloody Mary. Some people believe she's real, some not. Maybe I'll put don't know. Is your character from a shooting game? No. Is your character from a princess movie? Definitely not. Is your character older than 18? Don't know. Is your character associated with Five Nights at Freddy's? No. Is your character scary? Yes. Is your character pink? No. Is your character associated with anime? No. Does your character like playing Roblox? I mean, I don't know what she does in her spare time, but probably not. Does your character have black hair? I believe all the photos that I've seen of her, she does, so I'm gonna say yes. Is your character associated with mirrors? Yes. Does your character only appear when you say their name three times? Yes. Oh, I think a Bloody Mary. How did he guess that? I didn't think he'd be able to guess scary things. This is what I'm telling you guys. It sucks you in. I want to play more, but I need to stop myself. Anyways, guys, <laughs> that is the end of today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget, if you would like to win this new backdrop, head over to my Instagram, jessieb. Give me a follow. Send me a flower emoji. And yeah, I hope you guys have an awesome rest of your day, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Bye!